So you know in WhatsApp message or in Facebook Messenger where it says this message was removed or deleted? Well, there is a tool that allows you to actually read that. If you need that tool for whatever reason, don't worry, I got you. Let me show you what you need to know. Break it down now, phone. And welcome to another episode of Talking Tech with the Techie Guy. My name is Liron Segev, where I make tech simple. If you're into phones, gadget, apps, tips and tricks and how to, hit that subscribe button and let's get on to today's show. So we all know the rule by now. Never send anything that you don't want to appear on the front page of your newspaper, the trending page or the front page of Reddit, right? And yet we still do it. So many of us still have those oh dear, what was I thinking? I should never have sent that moment. The instant message applications have the facility to quickly delete a sent message before the other person sees it. Well, here's what happened. I was on a hunt for a tool that allowed me to unify all my incoming notifications, but one of the products that it does, it actually allows you to read those deleted messages. In fact, let me show you how it works much easier to explain it. Okay, so let me fire up my WhatsApp. You can see I've got an unread message and here you can see this message was deleted. There's nothing I can do to actually see what that original message was. Well, up until now. What we're gonna do is we're gonna fire up the Google Play Store on the phone and we're gonna install an app called Noti Save. N-O-T-I-S-A-V-E, it's got this little purple bell thing and click on install. Now, Notisave does two things. It keeps your notifications private, things that come in from various apps, and it exposes your messages that were deleted. It actually exposes what was said. This is the part I am most interested in. Of course, you can simply follow the prompts and set it up. So, Notisave. Once you go into Notisave, you go into the chat option, and you can see these are the list of applications that I have here. Anything coming in, it's gonna capture them. It sounds complicated, but let me show you how this actually works. So, let me go to my secondary phone. On that phone, I'm gonna send myself a message. Um, I don't know, what does this say? And send it. Okay, now it's sent. I'm not gonna to touch my main phone, but you can see I've got two little ticks here, which means it was actually delivered. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is, whoops, I made a mistake, I wanna delete that, so I don't want anybody to see it, so delete for everyone in this conversation. And now it's technically will be gone. Let me take my main phone, let's open that up. Yep, and in fact, that message was also deleted so I cannot see it. But I've got Notisave installed. If I tap on that, ta-da, there it is. This message is right here. It says, what does this say, which was the message that was sent. And then it lets you know that this is the message that was in fact deleted. That's pretty scary stuff, but pretty cool at the same time. Now, it doesn't just work just for WhatsApp. Let's go test this on Facebook Messenger. So let me send myself a message. Okay, there we go, very original, send. And now I'm gonna send another message and I'm gonna type something else in. Have you subscribed yet? Question mark, send that. I go, whoops, I didn't mean to send that. Let me get rid of that. Hold that down, click on remove and then remove for everyone. And then give another prompt to remove. Yes, I still wanna remove it. Great, now that's gone. Okay, so it says you removed a message, cool. Now, let me go back to my phone, open up Facebook Messenger, and you can see I received the first message, but the second message indeed says it was removed. Technically, that would be lost, but because I got notice saved installed, I simply go into that, and here you can see, ta-da, there is that message. Have you subscribed yet? And that was in fact the message that was deleted. You can even export it from here. So you can export it into a text file and you can share it. And then you can choose which messages you want to keep and then which messages you actually want to delete from Notice Save as well. Click on three little dots and do not save. Some more cool tips and tricks for your mobile phones are down here in these videos, which I'm pointing to frantically. If it's your first time here, hit the head below to subscribe. Give the video a thumbs up because you liked it and I'll see you in those videos. Over there.